motherfuckers. Monica should be here in like an hour or two, and we're just gonna start packing up this house, and we are gonna film the and Louisa all the way across the fucking country. I'm really stoked. These are my sweet friends that came to save the day. This fucking, yeah, that thing is heavy as shit. Would not fucking have been able to do this without them. <laughs> Hi, baby. Why are you always half naked, dude? Say hi to the camera, bitch. Hi. Look who's here. Mama came to save the day. But look how she fucking shows up, dude. Well, I cannot even believe you walked around the airport like that. What's wrong with you? God, you can take the girl out of Vegas, but you can't take Vegas out of the girl. I can't stop drinking about you. I got enough on the bed. I can't stop drinking about you. Without you, I ain't. Dude, so we're in this fucking U Haul, okay? And the RPMs are going to four. Like, I don't. I don't even have to push the gas and they're going to four. I have a car on the back that I don't think is there anymore. Oh, uh, I think I see it. Is it there? Uh, this fucking, mark my words, this transmission is gonna go out on this fucking. This is gonna blow. Fuck! I just wanna get the fuck out of Tennessee! Is that too much to ask? Jesus Christ! Jesus, take the wheel. Look at this, we are going. 40 miles an hour. Ugh. Oh my god! Stay tuned. Alright, so we're at the room. We're gonna take showers and then we're gonna get on the road. But first, I gotta tell Monica about this <laughs> fucking story. So, um, so last night, I had the room for like five days because the fucking water heater is busted. And I came in, I was supposed to check out yesterday morning. Came in and fucking took a shower, and my key worked. And I came in today and I was like, hey, can I just use my room really quick before checkout? He's like, you were supposed to check out yesterday morning. I was like, I showered in here fucking last night. He's like, how? I don't know, my key worked. And he's like, he's like, that's fucking weird. I was like, oh my god. So I showered in somebody else's room last night, and I don't know how it fucking happened, but it sure as fuck happened. Yeah. What a wicked game you play. Fucking little rock in the middle of the night, and we literally 
just pulled up to Waffle House to get some food, and this bitch has never been to fucking Waffle House. <laughs> My bad. She's so West Coast like I was. My really. bad. So I'm gonna have to fill her in on mm. some whiskey oh, yeah. weed and Waffle House. <laughs> <laughs> this is our first bite of Waffle House, motherfuckers. Oh yeah. Make love oh, to yeah. your mouth with that sandwich. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Get it, girl. Oh my, did you see her deep throat that bread? Holy shit. That was crazy. <laughs> Isn't it feel weird to chew on camera? <laughs> so good. Waffle House's thumbs up. Holler. Good morning, motherfuckers. Well, we fucking slept in because we were so fucking tired from driving last night, but we are somewhere in the middle of fucking, um, where are we? Arkansas? Little Rock, I believe. Yeah. Come on, man, you're always taking up my camera time. Um, and so today we're gonna fucking really haul ass and try to get at least fucking as far past Amarillo as possible because once we get past Amarillo, we're fucking home free. We get New Mexico, literally, I can smell Vegas on the horizon. Everybody's been texting me today, asking me if I'm okay. Oh my God, I can't believe this happened. We're gonna miss you, blah, blah, blah. And I'm just like, stop. Not like my dog died, you know? Like, fucking, no man defines me. I was fine before him, I'll be fine after him. And we're almost eight hours from here. Well, fuck, we did that last night. Yes. Yeah. So we'll be pulling in Amarillo about 8.30. If we can go from Amarillo, Oklahoma. Okay, okay, wait, no, no. We're gonna go from Arkansas to Oklahoma. Okay. To Texas. Okay. To New Mexico. Yeah, I was right. Woo, woo. Smarter than I thought. So yeah, our goal is to get to New Mexico tonight and then see how we feel. So if we can drive 12, that's 12 hours. If we can drive 12 hours today, we'll be good. Oh, that's easy. Okay, cool. Whoa. Come here, baby. We need to have a talk. Let's have a chat. Bring it up here, old chap. And then I'm gonna need you to go to the bathroom. Okay, you're gonna get a bladder infection if you don't go tinkle. And you're gonna be constipated if you don't poop, man. Don't you wanna poop? Don't get embarrassed and turn your head now. You're looking a little bloated, buddy. Yeah, you're looking like, you know, you ate a bunch of beef jerky strips last night, okay? Yeah, don't hide your face. It just, it happened. Oh no, it happens to the best of us, but you gotta poop, man. Every Bo is so shy that he will not shit or piss anywhere other than his home. <laughs> so this entire trip that we've been driving, mind you, we're in the middle of Little Rock, Arkansas, he has not peed since we left the house or shit. So we gotta work on this little bashful Bo. Yeah. All right, motherfuckers, let's get it. I just want you guys to see how good of a friend Monica is. <laughs> like, Look at this fucking chariot she's been driving. It's so long. <laughs> We don't have time to ride a pig. We're on a deadline, bitch. We gotta go. This bitch wants to ride pigs. She thinks just because we're in the country, you can just go and hop on a fucking pig, slap its ass, and call it a day. But you can cow tip. <laughs> Only when they're sleeping, I think. We're almost home. No, we're not. Yes, we are. Don't lie to these people. Just 19 getting... hours away. Yeah, 19 hours away from Vegas. Uh, oh my god. That's what she sounded like. Amarillo. Amarillo. Can't wait to just be an Amarillo because then that means that we are literally halfway, halfway home. And then when we see Arizona, I'm probably gonna shit my pants and cry and then smear it on the walls like a monkey. And let me tell you, this is my first time doing this drive. Oh, it's brutal. In that fucking thing. <laughs> Towing. <laughs> this is my shadow. <laughs> good morning, motherfuckers. Our actually good afternoon. It's been it's been a wild ride. We made it to Vegas. Yeah. And now we are rushing out of the house. Can't get my shit straight. We are rushing out of the house to go look at a house. Well, I have like four fucking applications in. 
on the houses. Bye puppies, we'll be back. Say hi to the babies. So hopefully one of them will get approved by tomorrow. It would be fucking ideal. Then it's day. How about that? <laughs> How about that? So in the we gotta come up with a nickname for him because I can't say his name anymore. No, um, so my ex tried to say that I'm using his name for fame, but whatever. So we're not gonna say his name anymore. Need you guys to come up with a nickname for him so that when we do talk about him, I'm not using his name for fame. If you can't tell, I'm being super fucking petty LaBelle about all this because I keep getting hit with Shit left and right oh, in my this oil. in my DMs and my inbox and text messages of bitches saying that they have been fucking with him. You know his ego is bigger than his Hey, hey listen man, I'm not gonna lie, I sucked all over that fucking little pickle. I believe that, I have to. <laughs> she did too. <laughs> you know, I I fucking spread fucking dainty flour around, dude. You know? What that, are friends for? <laughs> I mean that fucking shrimp kebab was just living life with me so I can't talk that much shit because you know what I did take that dick for you know two years so it is what it is all right we're going to look at this house I holla will. at your girls holla 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 <laughs> look how hot my mom is this is actually Sonia's mom but she's my mom too hey. beautiful she's showing me houses <laughs> how you doing good how are you okay. <sighs> Just got done house hunting. Was not amazing. I fell in love with two houses and by the time we were able to get absent on them, they had already uh, been taken. So, I have a house that they're trying to give me the lease on and it's kind of like the side bitch. It's not like the main bitch, it's not like amazing. So you're waiting for something better to come along. That's what's going on with the house hunting thing. I'm about to start working on this vlog. I'm excited to see how much i've grown over these past couple of weeks emotionally and just to see the change and stuff like that so we shall see day fucking three of trying to find a house and i think i'm gonna have to settle with the side bitch house <laughs> this is the fucking house that will not go away but it's always there old faithful we're at one of our favorite places though in vegas sunrise cafe shit and we found out more information on L Shitbag today. Apparently he's been having a relationship behind my back, which I already knew. I already knew there was somebody else. I just couldn't confirm it. I wish them luck. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just being petty because I have every fucking right to be. But that's my husband for you. He's a real fucking winner, that guy. Anyways, enough about them. Let's focus on the good. Later, skaters. My first night out since this whole shindig has happened. I have done this whole fucking separation completely sober. Not one drink, not one nothing. So tonight, I'm about to let my hairs down. The moose is loose. <laughs> the moose is loose. What
in so long. Can you help me out, AK? <laughs> I can't. Come here, baby. Just, yeah. just the tip. Give it to me, baby. Just the tip. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Oh, just the tip. That's all I asked for. <laughs> Dude, that's all I can take is the tip. That's it. <laughs> why I don't drink the next day just feel like ew so terrible I hate being hungover it's the worst feeling ever <laughs> Monica Monica has been trying so hard to back this fucking truck up it is so fucking funny to watch horrible friend I'm just sitting here laughing recording it so we are on the way to, I mean, we're so hungover, on the way to put all my stuff in storage because I'm going to fly out and meet Jay somewhere so that we can talk and so that we can possibly reconcile. But this is definitely gonna be another adventure. Stay tuned.